I've been playing terrain simulators for quite a long time now. If I had to guess, it would probably be eight to nine years. But do you know what else I've played for a really long time? Roblox. I've been playing that game for almost nine years, and I'm still having fun with both of them. But what were to happen if you were to play a train simulator on Roblox? Well, I decided to play some train simulator games on Roblox and answer the question, do they stand up to something like Trains Road Simulator 2019? So the first game that I found was called the Northeast Corridor Train Simulator. And it looks like it's a row scale train simulator of the Northeast Corridor. I still kind of like the style of game, but I guess the more interesting would be the full sized locomotives. Most things here seem to be game passes, so let's just try and see we, what we, we can get in the free section. Oh, it teleports me here anyways. Find address. Oh, that's me. I'm already connected to that locomotive. That's not supposed to happen. Or that shouldn't happen. Oh! Why is this happening? Next on the list was Rails Unlimited, which honestly I quite liked as a game, but I feel like they needed to add quite a bit more content to the game, as all you could do was just drive around. However, the scenery did look nice and it looked all very well put together. Oh yeah, and you can derail. In Steam Age, much like Rails Unlimited, you just drive around, going to different places on the map. The only difference being is that you pretty much only have steam locomotives, and you're in Britain. Streamlined is a game that arguably is one of the best Roblox train simulators, as unlike quite a lot of other games, you actually have a mission to try and make the best train you can. You have a bunch of selections of locomotives and cars, all from the 50s era of the Netherlands. It's got a pretty large map that you can all travel around and deliver either passengers or cargo to. You actually have to buy most of the locomotives and the passenger or cargo cars. The game looks amazing too. Since it's winter, there's kind of a snowy theme going on. But, once it clears up and becomes summertime, the game looks amazing with some of its sunsets, some of the light rays, and there's just a lot of detail everywhere in general. If you decide you want to play a train simulator on Roblox, I would 100% recommend Streamlined. And so, going back to the question in the beginning, can Roblox train simulators live up to real games? In my opinion, it depends on what you're looking for. If you're looking for like a tycoon simulator style game, then Streamlined is definitely the way to go. My description of it would be, it's transport fever, except you play the trains. If you're looking at something like you want to play like a model railroad, then going with row scale type games like the Northeast Corridor is something that you may be interested in. Or if you just want to screw around on an open map and play games like Rails Unlimited, then go right ahead. I'm not stopping you from having any fun. And speaking of fun, if you did enjoy this video, please do leave a big fat thumbs up and please do subscribe. It'll greatly help me out a lot. I'll see you guys all tomorrow with another Roblox and Trains video.